we might be in some trouble today. <laughs> it's gonna be a long ride. today oh man this one bad unit she's all right <laughs> <laughs> what's going on guys so i'm here with my buddy tristan i've known him for years he kind of comes around goes around whatever but uh he just bought a so what a 97 yeah a 97 ranger and it's on a sunday and we've got nothing to do so he was like hey let's go do some off-road and i'm like all right i know a spot so we are out here in the middle of nowhere in a undisclosed location and there is a lot of stuff out here that we're gonna go try to get stuck and the best part is that we have no cell service back here so no winches no rope yeah no winches no recovery stuff at all whatsoever we are two-wheel drive with a limited slip though and uh, we're gonna see what we can get into I mean, all else fails, we can pretty much just pick this dang thing up and push yeah. it around. <laughs> We've been back here a couple times, and uh, previous vehicles that shouldn't have been back here. In the car? Yeah, we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> but we're going to see how far we can go before we get in some serious trouble. But, uh, yeah, stay tuned. It's going to be one hell of a ride. Oh, yeah. So we are stock suspension, stock power. It's at 2.3. Yeah, 2.3 little... A little five speed that's okay we got some go juice got some nos if we need it uh custom light bar so one off adds what probably 50 horse oh yeah guaranteed got some mud tires a little bit of uh weight reduction on the windshield that'll help us out <laughs> all jokes aside it's a really good running truck uh, I've rode around it all weekend, and it's a solid unit. Just painted the grill and the uh, the bumpers black. There were some nasty faded chipping chrome. Just kind of sanded it down, and made it look a little better. But yeah, this should be a fun day. Let's get to it. He's awkward because he's never been on camera before. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna love it. <laughs> all right, let's get out there. She's got doing 40. <laughs>
Oh shit, what did you do? <laughs> oh man. You zigged when you should have zagged, buddy. <laughs> I think I did. Well, that discussion we had about no recovery gear. Yep. And we are in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I'd say we could just wait for someone to come along, but uh, this isn't exactly a uh, an open trail that a whole lot of people come down. I mean, it's an open trail, but nobody goes this way for good reason. A lot deeper than we thought, huh? Very. Yeah. Oh well. Well. What are we doing, buddy? Walk of shame. Walk of shame. Yeah, we got up underneath there and uh, it's high centered on a log or a big old rock, one of the two. So, remember what I told you about uh, not having recovery gear with us? It didn't look that deep. <laughs> it did not. But it was. And tried to go around it, slid off into it, tried everything we could. It don't matter if you're four wheel drive or not. When you're stuck high centered on a rock, it is what it is. So we are currently walking back to asphalt, which is, oh, how many miles do you think we're back here? Five, maybe five, six. five miles, I think it's about five miles. So we're hiking out, the sun's going down, but we know where we're at. I've uh, been back here a couple times. So uh, just never been on that trail before. No. And, uh, so we're hiking out of here and calling reinforcements to come take us to come get recovery gear, come along and chains and everything else. So we can just pop that rear end right off that rock or log, whatever it is, coast right out of there. But we gotta walk out of here, yep. go get everything, and then hike it all back in here. Yep. <laughs> After bending the bed up. Yeah, we accidentally bent the bed. But, uh, yeah, we got to go to work in the morning. <laughs> He's not so enthused. <laughs> so mad. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Fun little adventure is going to turn into quite the long video now. So, I'll keep you guys updated. All right, well, we just passed the sign. We've got two and a half miles left. <laughs> we are hot and out of breath, but we have salvation on the way. My wonderful woman is coming to rescue us. Take us to the store. I got hashtag no Toyota. <laughs> He's over here posting on Snapchat. <laughs> and we've got, what do you say, about 45 minutes of sunlight left? Every yeah, day. it's about a three hour walk back. Yeah. But we're making progress. We're gonna get out of here. Somehow. <laughs> but hey, we're on asphalt finally. So we're we're getting somewhere guys. Somewhere. <laughs> Well, about it. We've made it, guys. We need that. Yeah. It's got a winch. It does have a winch. That would definitely help. Thanks, honey. As you can see, it is now nighttime, and you cannot see Tristan. <laughs> I should probably turn the camera light on. All right. We have come along. We have a flashlight. We decided to go next door because Harbor Freight was cheaper. Toe strap. And we got a long walk. We're getting out of this. Yep. I got work in the morning. Me too. All right, ladies and gents, we are out. I did not record a whole lot because we were just trying to get out of there. So I will catch you back at the house. 
together. Thank you.